Hi, um, <clears throat> I'm Ashley, and I'm going to show you how to wear the Save Real dress and how to wrap it in many different ways. So the most simple way to put it on is to put the tube around your waist, and then this part, just tie behind your head like a halter. And then you can adjust the front piece any way you like, like this. Right now the sides are hanging down in the front. You can make it like this. You can bring it down and put it closed in the front. And jersey is this kind of magical material that will stay anywhere you put it for the most part. So a lot of the different positions in this dress take some finesse, but once you place the dress where you'd like it to be, it will stay. So now these pieces, you can do a lot of different things with. You can wrap them around your front. And tie them in the back. And it'll look like this, and then where you tie it will be right here. Let me show that. And if you want, you can put your, sh your shoulders through them, and then they become like sleeves, which I thought was pretty amazing. Then you can put your arms through them, put the, putting them in the back, and then they become kind of like a cape. So another thing you can do once they're through is wrap them to the front. So you can take them like this, tie them in the front, and then you have a closed back, kind of like a racer back. And then the front has two ties hanging. Let's see, what else can you do? I guess you can bring them up like this also. You could wrap them around your arms. Create sleeves. Now, the way to make this dress short is a little tricky, but it's possible. So you want to gently turn the skirt to the side and just take out the wrinkles. And now once the slit is on the side, you take the bottom, you probably want to get these out of the way for now. Take the bottom, move it to the length that you want it, and then wrap it around tightly. So I put one side here, and then one side like this, and then you just kind of smooth this piece. So you bring it all the way around. And you can make this fold up here in the front or the back. And you tuck it in to the skirt here. Then you can put these back down. So now you have a short dress with the tails in the back. You can also move these back to the front like this or do the shoulder thing. So now you have the sleeves. Just have to get them even, and then they should stay. Right. Now, let's see. When I play with this,
this dress in the mirror, I always come up with more and more and more ways to wear it. Um, okay, let's turn it to the side. So I'm going to move it so that it's like this. You can kind of position, this piece is a little flappy, you know, it'll, you can wear a fancy bra with it and have it show the bra, you know, or you can pin it to your bra in the front and then it'll just drape in the back. So right now the tails are down here, you know, you can do a variety of things with these. You can put one arm through this sleeve and the other arm through this sleeve creating a nice little drapey piece on the side. You see that there? And then the other thing you can do, which I think is pretty cool, is take the halter and put it on this side. And then you take the back one first this sleeve, and you can actually put your head through it, like this. Put this in the center, and then you take this sleeve and put your head through this one, and position it in the back. And now you have the one-sleeved dress, kind of an Asian look. And then this side will be open. Okay, um, what else can we do? Now if we want to move the dress to the back, you can just kind of finagle it to where you want it. We untie the halter, and then you just put your arms through the holes right here, kind of like a jacket. So these I usually put in the back, but you can put them in the front if you want. kind of straighten out the pieces, so then you bring the front like about to here, and then do the same on the other side, kind of grab it, kind of, you have to do this part a little bit gently, so that you get the right angles, and then you can tie this in the front, like this, or in the back, I'm going to tie it in the back. So here you have wrap dress, like this, and any little pieces that are sticking out, you can just fold them into something, like that. So now we have the Greek back, and these pieces again, you can, if you don't want them hanging back there. You can tuck them inside the back here and they'll stay. You can bring them around the front and tuck them in to the wrap part. And they'll stay wherever you put them. And again, you can wrap this in the front instead of the back if you want. Now, Gets to the exciting part. If you want to wear this as a cape, both ways that you wear it as a cape, you wear it backwards. So, right now, the bottom of the dress is around me. Let's see. Again, it can be a little tricky, 
But here we go. So here's the bottom of the dress around me like a cape. I can take this part and make it into a hood. Like so. Now I can wear it just like this if I want to. Or I can play around with it. If I play around with it, I might pull these in the back and then tie this in the front. And I get something like this. I might want to, let's see, what else can I do? Um, well, okay, so I thought this was pretty cool too. So, you can actually make this one of those caves that has armholes. If you want to, you can wear it like this if you want to. Let's see, I figured out a really cool way to do it. So, so if you have it just like this, it actually has the sleeves right here. So, you can do things. It's pretty flowy.